So today in the booth we've got two pieces from a Kawasaki Mule. Uh, it's kind of like an off-road, all-terrain vehicle. This one belongs to one of the local fire departments. Uh, they're doing a color change on it with these uh, painted pieces going from green to fire engine red. I'll put all of my uh, usual products that I use up in the upper left hand corner so you guys can see exactly what I'm using. So on these plastic pieces one thing I want to note for you guys is you gotta be careful when you prep them. Um, I would highly suggest using a gray scotch bright pad and at least 800 if not a thousand grit. I prepped these pieces with 600 thinking that I might be alright and for the most part I was but uh, there were a few areas where uh, the 600 left some scratches, some deep scratches and some pigtails. I don't know what kind of paint these things or any kind of stuff like this in general comes with from the factories but whatever it is it just kind of sucks to work with. Um, I would have almost been better off just to scuff the whole panels rather than even take any kind of sandpaper to them. So my recommendation is uh, 800 or 1,000. You can't get away with 600, but the problem is whatever kind of clear they put on these pieces, it clogs up your uh, sandpaper super, super fast, and you just end up with a bunch of uh, pigtails everywhere and. It can get ugly if you're not careful, so uh, I start this off using uh, one coat of North Star Sticks Adhesion Promoter and then I uh, move into the typical one coat of sealer. In this case, I'm using North Star Sealer, just the light gray epoxy. And uh, this job, because it's for a fire department, we actually use uh, the same color that we use on their fire engines which uh, we actually get in Sicken's base coat so I did uh, three coats of that before lunch I came back after lunch and I pretty much wet sanded uh, both these panels all the flat areas uh, I spent about I don't know maybe 30 or 40 minutes getting some dust out and trying to uh, flatten out some scratches from my prep work. Uh, both panels turned out awesome in the end. Um, so yeah, I gave, uh, after I wet sanded, after I came back from lunch and wet sanded, I gave uh, each panel two more quick coats of base just to make sure everything was covered up and then uh, moved on to the clear coat. I used the uh, PPG Deltron. DC 3000, two, two coats of that, and uh, that was basically it, guys. So uh, I'm going to stop talking and let you guys enjoy some paintwork. Uh, please hit the like and subscribe button. If you've got the time, I would greatly appreciate it. I've got plenty more videos coming, so stay tuned for those. Peace.
you can't stop now.